Off the rip. Lakers, baby. LeBron James. Still king. I mean, what can I say, man? You know what I'm saying? Braun talk. We're going to keep it quick, though. We're going to keep it quick and light because, you know, I don't want to bore y'all with too much Braun talk. But, yeah. Lakers going straight to the chip. What you thought? Braun talk alert. For your sake, I hope they do, man. What you mean for my... Yo, listen. I'm going straight to L.A. when they win this shit, man. So we got um, L.A. Lakers against who in the chip? It don't even really matter, man. It don't even really matter, man. And you know what? All is right in the world. I was able to get a pair of sneakers, set the world straight. Now, watch watch what happened. And I ain't going to hold y'all. The last time I bought a pair of LeBron Lowe's, LeBron won a championship. So keep that in your mind. All right? Lakers going straight to the chip. But that's a trail base. Man, it's a ups and downs start from the beginning of the season. And He's trying champions. to give you something over there. We're here. I love these guys. <laughs> <laughs> Mic check one two. Are we recording? Yes, ladies and gentlemen. The time I have been waiting for all year. Trail mix is back. NBA trail mix is back. Regular Mike here. I've been telling y'all. I've been te- I've been telling y'all. I know I, I just saw it, but I've been telling y'all what time it was, right? So we here. LeBron James, NBA champion. LA Lakers, NBA champion. Been telling y'all all year what time it was. But yo, we here, man. I'm here. You know, I'm here to just to, you know, I use, I know I usually got a bunch of things lined up for y'all. You know what I mean? A bunch of different things going on in the NBA. Not today. Not today. Braun talk is here. I've been waiting for this. You know what I mean? So, you know, congratulations to the LA Lakers, 2020 NBA champions, LeBron James, NBA champion for the fourth time, finals MVP for the fourth time. Excuse me, let me say that right. Finals MVP for the fourth time. And, you know, three different organizations, (laughs) champion, in three different organizations, Cleveland, Miami, LA. You know, it's just, you know, it's just king shit. It's just king shit, man. So, you know, I'm just here to talk my shit real quick, uninterrupted. Uninterrupted. I'm just here to talk my shit. You know what I mean? Salute to LeBron James, man. The internet is going crazy right now. I don't really feed into that. I don't really feed into the internet. To the internet trolls and and, and the anti LeBroners, nah, you know, like some 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 LeBron fans, LeBron wins and they just it, they they just feel like it's open season to debate. Not me, man. I just be chilling. I just be watching. You know what I mean? Because I know at the end of the day he's champion and it's nothing nothing nobody could really say right now. But I may be wrong because listen, let me tell you some of the things that I've seen said. Fake championship. Uh, it was too easy. Uh, what else? Uh, AD Anthony Davis carried the Lakers. You know, among other things. But I'm just here to say, you know what? A chip is a chip, baby. <laughs> Y'all criticize LeBron because all he do is is uh because because uh because he don't have enough championships, right? But listen, he got four now. You know, that's all I'm saying. So, you know, LeBron James, NBA champion, man. I'm not going to waste y'all time, man. We're going to the, we gonna get to the happenings of the NBA finals. I'm, I'm going to put some numbers on y'all. I'm going to show y'all some, some clips. You know what I mean? Nothing too crazy, but, you know, first things first. Salute to the Miami Heat organization. Pat Riley, Eric Spolster. It's a great organization, man. I've been I've been fronting on the Heat organization all year, as, as has been documented on on NBA Trail Mix more than once. Salute to the Miami Heat, man. Nobody saw them getting to the NBA Finals, even though you know it is in a bubble or whatever. But they made a they made a run. They knocked out the NBA MVP. You know what I mean? They beat the Boston Celtics. That's a strong team. 
They made a run, man. Hats off to the Miami Heat, man. Y'all had a strong run. But you know what? I really, I really, there's one guy specific. Jimmy Butler. I owe you an apology, dog. Because, yeah, listen, I've been slandering you for years because you did a couple things that I wasn't really, I wasn't really rocking with, you know what I mean? Especially down in Minnesota when you came in cursing people out reportedly. I wasn't really rocking with that because I didn't think he was that type of player to be coming in and, and, and um, you know, doing them type of things in organizations and such. But you know what? I apologize, man, because listen, what you did in the NBA Finals was amazing. You know what I mean? The Miami Heat, they, they, they wasn't, you know, they, they wasn't, they wasn't really, how can I say it? They didn't really have a chance. Like, let's keep it a buck. People was talking about sweeps. People was talking all types of foolishness, man. But, Joe, you came in and you had two performances for the ages. Game three, 40-piece, triple-double. The Laker bench, 46 of their 94 points. Pass inside to Olenek. Oh, what a feed from Butler. Hero sets the screen. Caldwell Pope picks him up. One-on-one. Butler backs in, backs in. That fallaway shot is up and good. 34 for Butler. It's an eight-point lead. And Butler, who's on fire, one-on-one. They switch. Everybody out of the way. Allow me to have this dance. And I'm not letting you off the hook. Gets to his spot, elevates, continues. 120 remaining. Butler says, give me the ball. Butler the drive, the runner. He banks it in. Oh, what a masterpiece from Jimmy Butler. Game five, 35 points, 11 assists, 12 rebounds. You damn near played the whole game. Butler one-on-one with Markeith Morris. Butler drives, falling away. Got it again. Jimmy Butler puts the heat back up by one. You Listen, salute to you, man. Salute to you. But we ain't here to talk about Jimmy Butler. We here to talk Braun, baby. NBA Finals MVP. He had another, another, another great performance in the finals, man. What can I say, man? Ron, what you gave him? Braun gave him damn near 30 points a game. Eight rebounds. Was it eight rebounds? No, excuse me, excuse me. Eight and a half assists. 11 rebounds. He shot 60% from the floor. He shot 40 plus, I think 43% from three. Y'all saw game five, man. Y'all saw what he did in game five, man. Game five, he had another dominant performance. He shot 70% from the floor, 40 points. Had it played that way all year long for this team. Averaged 15 a game as a rookie. Finished second in rookie of the year as LeBron James nails the three-pointer. Two of them undrafted. Caruso throws it up. And LeBron James easily banks it home. Danny Green, tough pass, gets to Caruso. James tries a three-pointer. LeBron James, his second three of the game. He's got 14. Caruso bumped him. Caruso pushes it up the other way. James tries another three-pointer. Puts it in. LeBron James now three for four from downtown. You know what I mean? He kicked it out to Danny Green for the win. You know what I mean? I know y'all killed him for that, but listen. LeBron James, man, NBA champion, man. You know what I mean? That's what we're here to talk about. Shout out to Kobe, too, man. R.I.P. Kobe definitely was a driving force in his championship run. But you know what? Listen, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the run. You know what I mean? I've been, I've been a LeBron fan since LeBron came in the, in the league. And this was the first run where I was just sitting back and I was just chilling, watching the games, man, because he was the favorite. You know what I mean? The last few championship runs, he wasn't the favorite. So he was, it was like he had to move mountains against KD and, and, and Steph and them boys. But this year, it was like, yo, listen, I already know what's about to happen, man. You know what I mean? 16 wins. They went 16 and five in the playoffs. And one, only one game, I was emotional. And that was game five of the NBA Finals. Because I really wanted that game five win. I really wanted to win it in five. You know, I think it would have been good a good stamp on a playoff run. You know what I mean? Um, but yeah, you know what I'm saying? NBA trail mix, regular mic, Braun talk. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna catch up to some of y'all too, man. We got to talk Braun, man, because why not? Why not, right? Why not? Salute to the Lakers. 
Salute to the Heat. NBA basketball, man. Salute to y'all. Um, for, for watching me through through all of the NBA trail mixes. Um, this is probably the last one for a while because I don't know when the NBA is coming back. Like they probably not coming back till like April or March or some shit. Cause they're not gonna come back till they get fans. They're not gonna do that bubble shit again. So you know, Ron talk, man. Regular Mike. Cheers. Hey, nigga, I was in Oakland. Oakland like Brooklyn. Short, down, sup, Yay yeah, area. Uh, it showed me so much love when I was down here. I had to get hype on this one. Uh, ask my nigga LeBron. It's so big, we ain't got to respond. When you talking to a Don, please have respect like you talking to your mom. We let the money do the talking. As you see, we be talking rather often. Awesome.